everybody, I'm Jeanette Thomas, and I'm here at the Orange County Shelter in Orange, California. I've been a volunteer here for just about 10 years, and I can tell you that during that time, I have seen thousands of amazing dogs come in, either as strays or as owner relinquishments, and I have also seen thousands of dogs that have been lovingly adopted. So today, what we'd like to talk to you about, or share some tips about, is what to look for when you're looking for your next best friend. It's so important when you're looking for another family dog is really think about your lifestyle. You want to know whether or not if you're active lifestyle or whether or not you're just a happy couch potato because that will make a huge difference in the type of dog that would really be best for your home. Now if you're an active lifestyle there are certain breeds that you'd like to take into consideration but we'll talk about breeds at another segment. But if you're active, you'd certainly love a dog that's a working dog. You'd love to have a lab or a husky or a shepherd or something that's large and wants to stretch and get lots of exercise. But if you're looking for a more sedate lifestyle, you may want to think about something like a Maltese or a Poodle or maybe even this little sweet little girl here that came in that just wants to be someone's best buddy on their lap. But one of the things I'd like to suggest before you come and look for your best friend, do some research. What you want to do is, you know, go on the AKC website and look at the breeds. The breeds will, for information, will really tell you what the dog wants to do, likes to do, and needs to do. Um, if you're going to get a husky, uh, don't expect it to be happy just sitting in your backyard all day. It'll p pretty much be bored, it'll dig, it'll howl, but if you've got a lifestyle and love to ride a bike, that's probably the dog for you and your family. So check about the breed. Also you want to think about in one of our series will be if you have another pet at home. Do you want the pet or does your dog want a buddy? And that's a really important thing to consider as well as the best way to bring that new dog home if you do have a resident dog. So stay tuned. We have a lot to tell you about, a lot of information to share and come on down to the shelter because I know this is a wonderful experience and you'll definitely find what you're looking for. Thanks for checking in.